The newly formed gun investigations team to help recover a cache of illegally trafficked assault style weapons. And WGN's Dana Rebick is here in studio with the details. Dana? Well, this is a federal case involving a man named Robert Narup from the St. Louis area who allegedly bought firearms at gun shows across the country and then illegally sold them to another man in Missouri who then brought those guns here to the Chicago area. Here are some pictures of those weapons, some of them found in a Schaumburg storage unit. They include multiple handguns, long rifles, and assault-style weapons. Criminal complaints were filed in U.S. District Court in Chicago today, accusing 30-year-old Jerome Boykin of selling these weapons to a 27-year-old man named Rogelio Mancera in exchange for marijuana. Mancera, who is from Schaumburg, would then allegedly resell the guns to various buyers on the streets of Chicago, including another man charged, 26-year-old Rodolfo Ortega. 71-year-old Robert Narup was arrested October 15th. 15th in St. Louis after investigators say he sold 18 firearms and two silencers to an undercover law enforcement agent there. These four men are charged with various crimes, including willfully dealing firearms without a license and gun possession during a drug trafficking crime. Now, this was a joint investigation between the ATF and the Chicago Police Department's newly formed gun investigations team, as you mentioned, that is a cross jurisdictional strike force aimed at reducing gun violence in Chicago. Two of these defendants appeared in court today. The other two made initial appearances earlier this week. They are facing various sentences if found guilty, anywhere from five years to a maximum of life behind bars. Back to you. All right, Dana, thank you. Dixman.